Hey, thanks for tuning in. My name is Hothead. Welcome to the show. Yo, I already put up eight countries of women around the world inviting passport bros to come over and scoop them the fuck up. <laughs> so for all the ones that's like, oh, they don't want you. They don't want the, the, the bros to come over here and whatever, whatever, disrupt their country. Um, that's been proven false. It's on my channel. And I'm quite sure you can find it on other people's channel. They're literally making videos saying, come get us. We want you American men. We want you from all the other places. They, they want us. You know what I'm saying? Yes, and I'm including myself because I'm about to do some fucking driving. Let's fucking go. Um, yo, so uh, the sisters ain't looking too good. I'm just saying. Like, they made the Thai news. Yes. With them ranting and and, and just straight up <laughs> embarrassing themselves and humiliating women of all different countries, they pissed off. Naturally, they pissed off. First, everyone you know from the different countries. You're talking about Thailand. You're talking about China. You're talking about I think even Japan is in there. You're talking about the Philippines. They all made their videos clapping back at them. Then now it's on the freaking news. Once it hits the news, you know it's really worldwide. I mean, what? this is a good example of think before you talk. You know what I'm saying? Because it's going to be shown everywhere. And now that it's shown everywhere, I'm just saying, girls, um, y'all might want to watch your back if you're if you're in one of those countries. Because <laughs> what I saw, what I'm about to show you. Yo, they, they might run up on you and smack you in your face. I'm just saying. And it, it, it's not even like they're probably just looking for the girls to sort of show. Them girls on the show is representing all the sisters. You know what I'm saying? And then you have other girls in their, you know, their apartments or at work or in their car also trying to make fun of them. So it's just looking like every black woman in America is out for them. It, it's disrespect, disrespecting them. So in their eyes, they're like... Oh, so it's beef. It's hands on. Let's go. You know what I'm saying? And you think I'm exaggerating, but yo, real clip. Let's get to it. Oh, all right, so let me translate what they're saying. Mm. I'm Captain. I don't know what I don't know if they say it. <laughs> but this is the clip that I acquired. And this, you know, the American show right there, they're showing it and they're gonna bounce back and forth between English and, and uh, Thai. But Basically, you should already know that show, and if not, please watch the other Passport Bro um, stuff I have on my channel. I have most of that stuff on there, at least the most important parts of it, and why everyone around the world is upset with these girls, as well as some of the other sisters that's, you know, making fun of them. But basically, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> this is proof. This is the real shit. They showed up on their, their new channel, and they're upset. Like, it, once it shows up on their news channel, it's going to show up on everyone's news channel in Asia as well as the rest of the world. Because just like we got it over here, oh snap, they playing, you know, <laughs> what the sister said, you know, on their show. I'm quite sure the other countries like, you know, Russia, England, all that stuff, you know what I'm saying? So you, you got to realize around the world, they looking at this like, so this is why the brothers don't want to deal with them. Oh, damn. This is what they got to go through? Oh, damn. This is the attitude? Oh, damn. And this also <laughs> contributes to why nobody, no, none of the other countries are coming to scoop up the sisters, you know what I'm saying, from America. You know what I'm saying? Like, and it's not me saying it. This is not me saying it now. This is, you know, statistics <laughs> that's been, you know, search, research, and research. You know what I'm saying? And look at this, look at this girl here. Look at this girl. Look how vexed she is. She is vexed. She is talking about hands on, on site when she sees these girls on the show. <laughs> like, and she's not the only one that feels this way. You know what I'm saying? Look at her doing kung fu. Yo, she is not playing. You have no idea. Y'all, y'all, y'all woke up the dragon. I'm just saying. <laughs> Yo, for real. Um, I think 
Y'all girls, if y'all if y'all just want to stay in America, I guess fine. Oh, look at her. She is flipping out. If y'all just want to stay in America, I guess that's fine. But if y'all trying to leave America, is y'all think y'all start y'all better start doing like an apology tour, maybe? Like <laughs> I mean, you know, unless you wanna catch those hands, I don't think you do, because if you're in that country, you definitely be crazy outnumbered. <laughs> I'm just saying. But on some real shit, yo, I know I'm laughing at the situation because I had never expected anything like this to go down. If you know, ask me about this like last year or whatever, I'd be like, oh, nah, I'm not like this go down. But, but on the real shit, yo, for real, I think y'all need to apologize and set things right, for real. Because we don't, we don't need y'all girls going to war, for real. Like, y'all should, you know, like, look, you know, it was wrong of us. We didn't realize what we were saying. We was upset. We was in our feelings. You know, let me, let's, let's correct this and, <coughs> excuse me, water under the bridge kind of thing. You know what I'm saying? But I know y'all pride ain't going to let y'all do that. But I hope, you know, at least some of y'all do it. You know what I'm saying? So it don't look like. All the sisters are out to, uh, yo, she is going in right now. <laughs> yo, so, you know what I'm saying? I hope, you know, at least some of y'all start doing it. So it don't look like all your sisters have beef with these girls, you know what I'm saying? Woo! Please do something. Girls, like, they're getting women from, like, the DR, Colombia, yes. uh, the Philippines, Thailand. Like, women can that can speak very little English, women that don't have education, women that... That need them. Women that need them. Whoa. Yeah. Wow. First of all, I come from Thailand. Yes, I speak little bit English because it's not my mother language. Education. What is about education for you? What is mean? You mean the just the piece of paper that proved that you graduated? Go. So, if your man is leaving you, question yourself why? Or ask him nicely. There should be the reasons. The way you blame another ladies how she from, how poor the country, the lack of the knowledge, the poor of the English. It doesn't make you look higher. Have you ever been to my country, Thailand? Or have you ever go to Philippines? I have a lot of Filipino friends. I can tell you one thing. You can't imagine how hard this woman can work. Not sit there and blame the other women to push them down and to make yourself look higher because your man is leaving. No wonder why your man is leaving you. Pay attention to the passport bros. Like they're getting women from like the DR, Colombia, yes. uh, the Philippines, Thailand. Like women can that can speak very little English. Women that don't have it, education. Not- well, actually, that is very true. It was really hard for me to learn English and be fluent in the language, especially because I speak five languages. So I woke up with all these videos of women attacking the passport bros. Oh wait, let me just take a sip of the coffee that my passport boyfriend made me. As I was saying, when you really don't care why they had to fly abroad to find a wife, a girlfriend, then why are you making all these hate videos? If you don't care at all, why are you reacting that way? You girls making these content saying all these nasty words against the women who were brought by the western guy to their countries is just an example why they don't Philippines, want- Thailand, like women can that can speak very little English, women that don't have it, education. Not- Hello! Speaking English fluently doesn't determine your level of education. I'm from Thailand, we have all language. English is not our mother tongue. And I will tell you something. Education is shown through a person's manners, 
attitude and outlook on life, not just their proficiency in English. We are not submissive like uh, someone mentioned earlier. We respect and treat our men as a king because we expect them to treat us back as a queen. Like they're getting women from like the DR, Colombia, yes. uh, the Philippines, Thailand. Mm. Like, whoa, whoa, whoa! Hello from Thailand. Um, oh, I'm feel so sorry to hear that from you, girl. So, let me defend myself. So, by the way, I'm Thai lady, and I'm married with Italian guy, and I have many friends married with American guy. So, I feel so sad, and a little bit mad. You said like we speak little English and we have no education. You're wrong about that, girl. Now, two thousand twenty three. Here, we Thai lady, we education, but our English is not perfect because it's not my mother language. You know, can you speak Thai? No, I can speak Thai. I can speak Chinese. I can speak English, and now I learn Italian. Mm hmm. I will not stop to learn. Ah, let me tell you something. Why you men like to fly and travel all over the sea to fight Filipina, fight Thai girl, fight Thai uh wife and lady? Because we know how to teach our man like a king. You want to be a queen. You need to teach him like a king, not just only think me, 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 me all the time. We are respectful. We know how to cook. We know how to clean. But you said maybe you man like Asian girl, oh, because we easy to talk control. No, no, no. We not have big head like you. We are respectful. We are thinking about our man first because it's love and respect. You understand? Get out of your little box and come to Asia. Go to Philippines. Come to Thailand. I will show you around. You will fall in love with my country because we are kind. We are nice. We are respectful. Get out. Of your country and see the world go to be rescued from their poverty stricken life of no opportunity. The truth is, that these American men are trying to be rescued from you, Karen. Where when we're looking for an ideal guy, they have to be above six feet, make at least six figures. <laughs> <laughs> oh. You're on OnlyFans, though. Okay, that isn't something a high value oh, woman does. Now doesn't matter He's only so he barely making he make a thousand dollars a week that's nothing came to me and said i've slept with a thousand men because i was broken and i had been abused and blah blah you blah. still slept with a thousand men where's the compassion in that? i'm not thinking about i'm thinking about you've had a thousand if you your to be with someone shouldn't compassion be a main factor in that relationship right? like that's entitlement you're not, an, you're not a, you're not entitled to someone's compassion and understanding and you, i think men are allowed to be selective in who they date and like i, I think men are allowed to have standards and if that's their standards they'll be it.